Do you want a gravy bowl? Oh, hello. Oh, you want to sit next to me. Where are you? Hello. I think his first gravy bone of the day is as good as like the first coffee of the day. Did you enjoy that? Did you? Oh, I missed you when we were away. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so cute. Hello again, it's 1.30, it's Saturday afternoon. I've just um, got out of the shower, so I'm just getting ready. And Toby is off to a party um, at two o'clock. So I'm gonna drop him there. Then I'm gonna come back and do a little sneaky video, um, which you might have already watched by now. So that's what I'm gonna do this afternoon. And then I've got a gig tonight in Essex, a little holiday park. It's not little actually, it's quite big. It's a big holiday park, um, Steeple Bay Holiday Park, which is a park holiday. So that's the um, name of the company. So I'm on stage at nine o'clock for an hour tonight. You still look so lovely with your haircut, don't you? So, and I really missed you. I really, really, really missed you. Did you miss me? I think you did, but you were friends with uh, Lee's dad, weren't you? You hung out with uh, Lee and Lee's dad. Look at the state of our house. So, I know it has to get worse to get better, but slowly, slowly it's coming together. So, Lee's dad, who is helping us with the house, he's got rid of all the wallpaper. So, this is like the landing area. And, um, yeah, so it looks like this. I came home and I was like, oh. But I know it'll look better eventually. We've just got stuff everywhere still. Um, so yeah, this is what it looks like at the moment. But it will be very nice soon. We'll have nice walls. I can actually do videos there. This is up on the landing and then we've got the sofa bed. I can set the um, tripod up and do a video from there. So this is what it looks like at the minute, doesn't it, Rufus? And then downstairs. That's what downstairs looks like. Uh oh, but I know eventually it will be lovely. But I better get ready because I'm just faffing about as usual, so I'm going to go put my makeup on. I'm just getting ready and I realise I haven't done my mug of the day. I've put a picture on Instagram, but I haven't done it on YouTube and this is where it started. So here is my mug of the day and this is from B&M and it's just lovely. I love this mug, enjoy the little things. And I do try and do that. I think these are very important words. I think this is one ninety nine from B&M or one forty nine. I can't remember, maybe 199, but it's lovely. And I've got a coffee. Well, I think it's like my third or fourth coffee of today. So cheers, mug of the day. I've just dropped Toby off to his party and I've come home and I've locked myself out because I went out the back way, but I locked, double locked the front door last night, the top and the bottom. Uh, so it's, uh, I'm locked out. Yes, the door's locked. I was like, no! Um, so I've just called my mum uh, so she can let me in. She's got a key to our house. She's just at Tesco, so I'm just waiting. I'll have a sit down at the front and uh, I'll reply to comments so I'll use my time productively. That's what I'll do. Bessie's come up for a little sleep. Hello Bessie, I missed you when I was away. I did. Missed you so much. And of course missed you Rufus. Hello? Hello? You're gonna fall off. You're gonna fall off the bed. Look at the floors there, crazy dog. Luckily I'm here to stop you. I think Bessie's tired, aren't you? Rufus isn't tired, are you, Rufus? No! <laughs> and I'm just recording the little sneaky extra video. It's not really much of a video, it's just I need your questions, basically. So I'm going to do a question and answer video for next week. So I thought I'd just do a little hello, I'm back video. So if you've got any questions for me, um, go over to the question and answer video, this one that I'm about to record, um, and then write them underneath. So I'll link it below in case you um, you have a question, but you might have already watched that video. So I'm going to crack on because I'm running out of time. I was locked out, so I couldn't start this video. Um, and it's now about 10 to 4, so I've got about 20 minutes before I've got to go and get Toby. So I'm going to, yeah, quickly do this video, and then I will speak to you later. The sneaky video is done. I've nearly edited it. Edited it is hard to say, and I'll put that on when I get home from picking Toby up. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm just going to get Toby. That party is Zoom by. I love drop-off party, but that literally it went so quickly probably because I was locked out as well so I'll go and get Toby and I've got some little cereal bars to eat because I, I haven't eaten I don't forget not to eat much but um I have today maybe uh, that's a sign because I've eaten so much on the holiday so I'll come back to you a bit later when I've got uh, Toby and before I leave for my gig tonight just heading off to my gig tonight Toby's gone to Granny Pat Pat so I just dropped him off I say dropped him off and walked around the garden I was like bye so he's staying there tonight because Lee is away Lee is in Amsterdam 
and Dublin. So it's gone to Amsterdam for two nights and then they've gone to Dublin for one night. I don't know, they're just having fun, they're like a boys weekend. Um, it's almost 6.30 and I'm just heading off to Essex, Steeple Bay Holiday Park. So I'm just gonna put it in the sat nav, have a bit of a faff around with my, just checking I've got everything. Takes me about 10 minutes to leave. Like I just sort of make sure I've got everything, check things, I get comfortable, check I've got snacks, water, and then, uh, and then I drive. And then I drive, so I've got my glasses in there for later, my spectacles and then my sunglasses for now because it's hot. Not hot, sunny. So yes, I'm going to go off uh, now, well, in about eight minutes after a bit of faff time. I've just arrived at Steeple Bay Holiday Park and the sun is really pretty, not the sun, the sky. Looks lovely. So here I am, I'm going to drive through and the time is 8.30, so I better get a move on and get backstage. I've done my um, set on my iPad, my dress on, some makeup, so I'll probably go on stage in a couple of minutes time. It's really busy out there. The manager's so lovely, she's called Hayley, um, so she's going to press the buttons for me and hopefully I'll have a good night. Welcome, greetings, Earthling. <laughs> Welcome to the... Vlog. Yay. It's, it's Sunday. It's Sunday, isn't it? And the time is 20 past nine and I'm off to the car boot sale. Where are you Ooh, going? I'm going to Grandad. To watch the football. I'm going to the car boot sale. Woo! You have a big, big clue who's playing. Yep, yeah, the big clue is there. And it is... Get and get it at... Mm, duh! England. What's the score going to be? I think it's going to be 2-1 like always. Who are they playing? Panama. Ah, so 2-1 to them. Yeah. We shall see. Toby predicted that the other day and he was right. So we'll see if he is today. So yeah, I'm off to the car boot sale. Toby's off to Grandad Brum Brum's and I'm going to go and see if there's any bargains. Do you want me to look out for stuff for you, Tobes? <laughs> Grandad Brum Brum. Meat, pie, sausage roll. Come on, England, score us a goal. You said Ossa. Ossa? Yeah, you should. But he's my favourite player. <laughs> okay, meat, pie, sausage roll. Come on, England, score me a goal. Nice, no, score a goal. Okay, meat, pie, sausage roll. Come on, England, score a goal. Yeah. Can we do it together now? Three, two, one. Meat, meat, pie, pie sausage, sausage roll. roll. Come, Come on, England, England score, score a goal. goal. Toby has been dropped off. He's with his grandparents, so he was all happy in this little. He's got a David Beckham England top on. It looks so cute with his little shorts and his red socks. I really hope England win because it'll mean a lot to Toby. Um, and obviously, I, I want them to win for England as well. But you know, it means so much to kids, doesn't it? Um, so I'm at the car boot sale at Julie's car boot sale. There's some stalls and things. So I'm going to go and see if they've got any bargains. Now, I don't really need anything because I've got lots of things. Um, so I'm going to try and be quite um, picky with my stuff because some I used to go well I can go a bit crazy and just like <gasps> and buy it because it's so cheap and cute but I'm gonna I'm gonna pace myself I'm saying that now but let's see what happens found a few things, some jeans and a little sticker book, like a the World Cup little sticker book for 20p, which is really good because Toby was um, after one of them. And I think it was like a fiver in the shop with some stickers, so that was a really good buy for 20p and he'll be happy. And I saw my friend Marie and she only bought one thing. I said, oh, is there much here? And she said, no. I was like, oh no. But um, I'm having a little round. I've got a few things. Oh, I've just spied a mug. Hang on a minute. It looks cute. The mug had a big pig on it, so it was really nice from one side, but with a big pig, it looked like it was a bit dirty. <laughs> so I left that mug. Let's see what else there is. Such a nice day. It's really it's perfect car boot sale weather. There's no wind. Um, yeah, it's just really pleasant. So I'm just taking my time, seeing if there's anything here that I really need. There was a, a haggle battle. Oh, hang on, there's some stuff over here to look at. There was a haggle battle just then uh, with the. There was a bit of a standoff. I found some um, some body lotions, molten brown ones for 50p, but yeah, they were arguing over a price, so I didn't know what happened in the end. I'd had to go, so it was awkward. That little dog. Funny, has got a little outfit on and everything. I just got 
one of the best bargains ever so exciting it's a mug and it's a make that I love but I never buy well I think I bought one mug from John Lewis um, because I really wanted it and I just got it for 10p and I'm so excited so when I do my car boot sale haul I'll show you what it is but yeah I was just like no way that's 10p it said all mugs all mugs 10p and it was at the front and I was like ah so I got it so happy I'm just on the last bit now so I've got uh, two big bags two big bags but not like loads just um, bargains that I needed. I did need them. So I'll show everything. I'll do a car boot sale haul this week um, and show you everything I've got. I've also got to show the clothes that I bought last time, so I might just do that all together. Or maybe a separate clothes haul and then things I found today. So let's see if there's anything on the last little bit here. The last stretch, and then I've got a little bit at the top. And, uh, and that'll be, that's everything then all the stalls. I didn't go mad, I've got two bags, so not too crazy. I think I spent about 15 quid in total and got some really good bargains. So I'll do a car boot sale haul um, and I'll show you like the, oh, the thing I, the mug I found for 10p, which I'm so excited about, just because I couldn't believe it. So I'll do a car boot sale haul next week and the time is, it's about five past 11, so I'm gonna go home and it's so hot, so lovely. Such a nice day. I might actually pop to another car boot sale. There's one, uh, the race course in Great Yarmouth, there's a car boot sale there. So I might just see if um, if anyone's still selling stuff, because right at the end you get the bargain. So I might just go and see if there's any, anything there. There probably won't be, because everyone will be packing up, but you never know. So I shall go there and have a little wander around. This might be the only boot sale I go to where I've never bought anything, because there's no cars, they've all gone. challenge see if I can't buy anything. I found one thing I got a book this was 25p um, and it looks really good just as on the back this book is a gift you can keep it or pass it on but we think you should try it because be, because <laughs> because everything changes when we read and it, uh, Joe Brand said it's very good and Simon Mayo says maybe the most important book I've read this year so 25p I thought well it's worth um it's worth buying it's so cold here so this is the race course car boot sale and julie's car boot sale was really warm there was no breeze it was lovely it's so cold there it's so windy my hair's just gone really ratty and uh, yeah I'm, I'm cold so i've just got back in the car um to warm up so I, it's just mad i didn't think it would be like that obviously it's all open here but julie's car boot sale is uh, is better because there's no wind so I'm glad I went there though and found that out. Um, so I'm going to go home now. I'm going to have some breakfast and I'm going to put my treasure upstairs all ready to do the haul. And I'll pr try and do that tomorrow if there's time. I'm now back home. The England match is on. I've just had some lunch. I had some um, cream cheese on toast with a coffee. This is my mug of the day. Um, I love the handle. This is a pound world one. Um, I love the handle. That was only a pound. Um, and I've just put a picture on Instagram of my um, Pip Studio mug, the 10p one. That I said it was a mega bargain. So have a look on Instagram. You might have already seen it. So I'll do the car boot sale haul um, next week. But oh, it's such a cute mug. It's actually very small. I'd have a cup of tea in there, like an evening decaf tea. That's going to be, that's going to be my evening decaf tea mug. Um, I'm going to go outside in a minute. So I've still got my um, sunglasses on because they're prescription ones, so I can actually see. Rufus is here. Hello, Rufus. Hello. He, sm he smells a bit. He's just come in. I don't know, he rolled in something. Um, what was I going to say? Tesco's coming in a bit with some food, because we've just got... You know when you come back from holiday, you, just, you haven't got any proper food. You've got bits and bobs, like stuff in the freezer. So I've just been using some of that stuff up. So we'll have some... Yeah, proper food in a minute from Tesco. And I'm going to I'm gonna watch a bit of the England match. I thought I'd just put it on the radio, but I kind of want to watch it a little bit. Oh, what's wrong with me? I've changed. I used to hate football. Toby's not even here or Lee, but I'm just gonna I'm gonna keep an eye on it. That's what I'm gonna do. But I'm gonna make another coffee. Um and I've just been oh yeah, so I did put um uh, obviously a video on yesterday saying have you got any questions for me? Um and there's such good questions. So oh the Yankee candles that really burn in the background. How do you stop that? Why did that go so high? How do you stop like the blackness on the top? If you can see that don't like the look of it. Um, they smell nice, but they're, 
that, I probably can wipe it off, can't you? If, if you um, know what to do, let me know. So yeah, the questions are really good. Um, so I will answer them next week. But what should I do? Should I, there's loads of questions. Should I do two parts? Let, please let me know. Should I do two parts? So Q&A part one, Q&A part two. Or should I just go for it and do one big long one? I don't want to be too long. My videos lately have been so long. Also, let me know what length video you like because when I'm doing them you can never really tell how long or how short they're going to be so if it's like 15 minutes that's like a good length let me know or if you like them a little bit longer um, I just don't want to like bore everyone if you know what I mean not bore as in like but you know they're a bit too long um, it's just hard sometimes trying to cut it down cut 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 um, right so I'm going to watch some England football make a coffee and go in the sunshine as well that's my afternoon nice afternoon I like it I like it Day off, yay! Hello Rufus, what are you doing over there? Oh, what are you doing? <laughs> Gonna get your chicken ticket. Oh, are you having a nice day? They love it when the weather's nice, don't they? And then when they get too hot, they go in the shade. Is it nice as lying out here? Yeah! It's such a nice day, it's so peaceful. There's a, there's a really light breeze, but it's, yeah, it's just so nice and warm. They just said, um, I heard on the radio, it wasn't just now, it was like half an hour ago, um, it's going to be nice for seven to ten days, like sunny, which would be really good. We deserve that weather, don't we? So I'm looking forward to that. Um, I'll just quickly show you the dress that I've got on. And it's got like little zebras on it, if you can see the zebras. And I've not worn it till today. So, you know, people say, oh, if you haven't worn it for however long, then you'll never wear it. Well, I don't believe that because... Um, I've got this dress on and I love it. It fits really nicely and it's lined and um, it's a nice length. It sits just on my knees, which I like. Right, I'm gonna go inside and see how uh, England are doing. Are you coming with me? Or are you staying there? I think he's staying there. He's quite happy in his little spot. Oh no, here he comes. Here he comes. Lee's having a great time. They're now in Dublin. I'm sure they're having great fun. Right, I'm gonna sit down all oh, nil-nil. Been on for 29 seconds. But Toby's loving this with Grandad Brum Brum. Do you want a... <laughs> Where's he going? Sit. 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 No, Rufus, sit. I'm doing the gravy, but that's the gravy bone dog. <laughs> England are 5-0 up at the minute. Um, so obviously they're going to win. They're going to beat Panama. They're going to win this game. So there's going to be a lot of happy people. Toby's going to be like so happy because Harry Kane scored a, a goal or two. Has he scored two? I don't know, one or two. Um, so thanks for watching the vlog. I'm going to end it here because I want to upload it tonight. So I'm going to get it together and put it on for this evening. Um, and then I'll do the car boot sale haul for tomorrow. So you'll have one tonight, one for tomorrow rather than two for tomorrow. So yeah, thanks very much for watching. And I will um, speak to you tomorrow then with the car boot sale haul. Okay, see you. Bye. Rufus! And it's a, a bye from Rufus as well. Oh, he just said, he actually said bye. <laughs> you said goodbye, didn't you? Aww.